You guys are actually crazy. Like, what? You're gonna make me cry. Right. I'm gonna put this on the floor. No, I'm not. <laughs> I don't know what to do with them. There's too many. Right. Don't pull, don't pull, don't pull. Okay. Oh my goodness. Put that back. Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name's Lucy and today I've got my birthday book haul. <laughs> I just want to say straight off the bat, I did not expect any of this and I'm actually shocked. <laughs> my parents were honestly flabbergasted <laughs> that they so many Amazon parcels were turning up at the house and they thought that I had purchased all of these books and then when I said no 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 <laughs> they are from some lovely kind humans on the internet they couldn't believe me and words cannot actually ex express how grateful I am I really just want to say that just thank you to every single person who got me a book or a gift or a gift card of something like like ugh, seriously you guys are actually amazing thank you so much but i think without further ado we should get into what books are in these parcels <laughs> so i do want to quickly give a shout out to kira who got me a gift card thank you so much lovely and um, i'm yet to use it i'm saving it for when i really am desperate to get a book but thank you very much i did get your email so let's just pick up randomly the first parcel. Um, let's see if we can open this. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of that today. Okay, so let's, that, that's the receipt. Where's the note? Ah. Here's the note. It is, Oh, from Yaya. Happiest of birthdays to you. Thank you for being the Sister Dale Sunshine. Thank you so much. And they got me The Traitor Queen by Danielle L. Jensen. This is the second book in the Bridge Kingdom series. And I really, really enjoy the Bridge Kingdom. So I'm so excited to get to the next one. Um, this is an enemies to lovers um, fantasy romance where we're fo following Leia. Is that her name? Lara and um, we're following Lara as she's been sent to the enemy kingdom to marry their prince and to assassinate him for control over the British kingdom that um, stops different imports going to her own kingdom and then ensues a romance between them so I'm really, ha really, really, really excited about this so thank you so much I'm gonna put all of the uh, gift notes in the front page of the book so I don't lose them. Right. Oh, don't. Oh. Honestly, I don't have the room for this. Right, next one. Right, let's see if I can get the note out first. Yes. Oh, it's from Simone. Oh, lovely. It only seems appropriate I gift you one of my fave Olympus couples. I haven't read this yet, but I hear it's a fun, spicy read and not really a retelling, so hold your tits. <laughs> Happy birthday from Simone. Oh, thank you so much, for Simone. Um, Simone has her own um, channel called Beyond Bookish, so I will link her below. And she got me Neon Gods by Casey Roberts. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I saw this in Waterstones the other day and I was like, mm, should I pick it up? Should I not? So I'm so glad I didn't. Because I've got it. Uh, I've heard so many people rave about this. Um, yeah, so as Simone mentioned, it's a Persephone and Hades retelling. Um, it's a modern retelling that's as sinful as it is sweet. I'm excited for this. Thank you so much. 
next one. Oh, that one did not work well. Let's try the other side. Okay, this is not a good one. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to rip it. No. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Let's see if I can find the note. Yes. Here it is. This is from Joe. Oh, thank you so much. Happy birthday, Lucy. Jeff cancelled my first gift to you after it was already sent out, so I'm attempting again. This one, it this is one of my favourite dark academia dark academia books so i hope you don't end up hating it lots of love from jolie thank you so much though and i'm so sorry that jeff cancelled your order that's really quite mean of him oh and she got me if we were villains by ml rio and yes this definitely is dark academia that is why i put it on my list i just know that apparently this is going to be one of the best dark academia and i just want to get into that sort of um genre i guess uh more i'm absolutely no idea what this is about so this says oliver marx has just served 10 years for a murder he may or may not have committed on the day of his release he is greeted by the detective for who put him in prison detective colburn is retiring and he wants to know what really happened a decade before okay okay that sounds intriguing thank you so much right this is a smaller fat one where's the little oh it's this oh that was a good one right here's the note oh it's from day happy birthday lucy i'm so happy to have a beautiful soul like you as my friend and that the citadel brought us together i hope you have an amazing birthday and i uh, and i am so excited for nola from day thank you so much day and oh i'm so excited so excited for nola Right, so, oh, so yeah. oh, and it's in the yeah. Right, so this is The Angels Game by Carlos Rizzo Saffron. I really cannot say his name. This is from the author of Shadow of the Wind, and I absolutely loved Shadow of the Wind, so I want to continue on with the series. And oh, I'm so excited for this. It's gonna be so good. So, so good. Oh my goodness. Right. Oh, so just like the tagline on this is like a heady brew of detective thriller, supernatural horror tale, magical realist fab fable, and a heartbreaking love story. If that doesn't sound amazing, I don't know what does. Thank you. Okie dokie. This one can just be lifted off, I think. Oh, that was sticky. Huh? Haha. <laughs> oh. Not that one. Where is it? No. <gasps> no. This isn't a. Mm. Does it say who it's from? No, so I've got the receipt. But not the actual no, oh no. Okay. Okay. I will I will find out who sent me this. But someone, this lovely, lovely person, sent me Count Your Lucky Stars by Alexandra Belfler. This is the next book in the series of the Written in the Stars trilogy. And oh, this one follows Margot, and I love her so much. It's a, a romance series that's set in Seattle, and I'm so, so, so excited to be going to Seattle. So it's going to be good. So this says... Will this be their second chance at first love? And it's a sapphic book. Thank you to whoever got me this. Please let me know in the comments who this was because I'm really upset that there isn't a note. Right, last one of this pile. Oh. Ah, 
There we go, that was better. Uh, aha! Right. <gasps> Hanani! Oh my gosh. Happy birthday, Lucy. It's been such a joy to know you, and I hope you have a wonderful day from Hanani. Thank you so much, Hanani. And she got me an heiress's guide to deception and desire by Amanda Collins. This, I've wanted this book for so long. Um, this is the second book in the, um, from the, yeah, it's the second book to A Lady's Guide to Mischief and Mayhem. I really, really enjoyed that book. Uh, so this is The Partners in Crime and Enemies in Love. So I'm so excited. And this is a historical romance. So as you can probably tell by the cover, but oh my goodness, this is so cute. <laughs> Oh, I'm so excited to read this. Right, okie dokie. Let me put this in here so I don't lose the note. And now we're on the last pile. So, oh. It's falling. <laughs> oh no. Right. Stay. Stay. Right, here we go. We've got this one. Oh, why does he never work? Like, actually, that one, that time works. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, oh, ho, ho, ho. A JLA. Let me get the note out. Okay, ah, uh, from Christina, thank you so much. Happy birthday, Lucy, you're an amazing person. I'm so happy that I got to know you. I hope you'll enjoy this book. Thank you so much. And this is The War of Two Queens by Jennifer L. Armentrout. I believe this is the fourth book in the From Blood and Ash series. Um, I've only read the first one, so I really need to up my game, but I am, I do want to own them because I will eventually read them. I don't even want to look at the synopsis for this because I probably will get spoiled. But the first book follows Poppy as she is the maiden. She cannot be seen, cannot be touched, cannot be like talked to or anything. Um, and she's shrouded in a lot of mysteries and then enters her bodyguard and he sort of upheavals all of what's happening. And there is some supernatural elements to that as well. And it is kind of an enemy to lovers as well, I would say, kind of. Yeah, I would say I'm enemies to lovers. But thank you so much. I'm so grateful. Right, this is a nice little small one. Oh, I really hate Amazon packaging. Oh, that was almost, almost okay. Right, okay. Who is this from? Oh, it's from Esme. Thank you, Esme. It says, happy birthday, Lucy. Thank you so much. And this is, I can get it out. Fangs. Oh my gosh. I've wanted this for ages. It's a love story between a werewolf and a Roma. Um, a werewolf and a were... Why can't I speak? A vampire and a werewolf, hence the Fangs title. And it's a graphic novel. So I'll give you a little flip flip through there we go oh this is so and it's hardcover as well it's beautiful thank you so much Esme okay next one let's see if the tab works no nope, tab doesn't work this side tab worked yay <laughs> okie dokie that's the receipt. Is there a note? Yes, there is a note. Clea, happiest of birthdays, Lucy. I, it has been so, why can't I speak? It has been so great becoming friends in the city now. You are such a lovely person. I hope your birthday is as lovely as you from Kilia. Thank you so much, Kilia. You are such a star. Oh, oh, they never look. Yes. I've wanted this book for so long. <laughs> 
so this is kind of me trying to get more into thrillers so this is they never learn by laney fargo um i actually don't know what this is about but i know it's a thriller um it's set in a university right oh it's about this professor who kills bad men and people are trying are cutting on to the fact that a lot of men are dying so now they're investigating it i remember this now oh this sounds like such a cool premise oh <gasps> thank you so much Kalia. uh where is it oh there it is that was a good one. Oh my goodness that was really good right this uh there is a note Oh, Lucy, thank you so much. Happy birthday. Hope you have an amazing day. Love from Lucy. Oh, this is from Lucy, from Library of Lucy. Oh, gosh. Anyone that I've mentioned, that if they have a channel, it will be linked below. Oh, thank you so much, Lucy. Oh, No Exit. Yes. Oh, my God. Okay, No Exit by Taylor Adams. I've wanted this book again for ages again another trying to get into thriller moments um this is a kidnapped little little girl locked in a stranger's van no help for miles what would you do so it's set in the snowy wilderness i think and it says a gripping thriller full of heart-stopping twists so thank you so much lucy i I'm so excited to get to this book. Right, here we go. Hey, that works. Right, is there a note? Oh, there, there's a note. Ah, Chelsea. Happy birthday, beautiful from Chelsea. Thank you so much, my love. Oh, Desperate Measures by Katie Roberts. So I am trying to get more into some dark romance, so this is going to be so good. And this is the based on the Disney villains, um, yeah, it's Disney villains, isn't it? Isn't this Jafar? Yeah, this is Jafar and Jasmine and Aladdin. So I'm excited for this one, thank you so much. Oh. Okay. These two are stuck together. <laughs> I don't think they're meant to be. So I'm gonna try unstick them. Okay, so now we're on the last two. I'm gonna see, I'm just gonna pull the books out. Oh, Red Rising. Oh, I, yeah, I wanted to read this as well. And I think Mel Reads is gonna be doing a read along of this. so. I wanted a copy. Thank you. Uh, oh, there's two books. Oh, and The Rage of Dragons by Evan Winters. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Oh uh, yeah, this, basically, I bought this because of Aaron from Book to Busy. That is the whole reason. Yes, let me get the note out. Which one is it? These two. Oh, it's from Victoria. Thank you. Happy birthday, Lucy. I really want to read this series, so hopefully we both love it. Enjoy. So that's going to be for Red Rising, I believe. So thank you very much. You got me two books in December, so I need to do the same thing. Happy birthday, girly, and I hope that one is great read. Thank you so much, Victoria. I, oh, thank you so much. This, oh, honestly... So this is supposed to be a Game of Thrones meets Gladiators type fantasy debut. And I'm here for that. I'm so here for this. And then Red Rising is sci-fi. This is by Pierce Brown. The Earth is dying. Davro is a red, a miner in the interior of Mars. His mission is to extract enough precious elements to one day tame the surface of the planet and allow humans to live on it. The Reds are humanity's last hope, or so it seems. Oh, okay. I'm so intrigued by this. I, I, yeah. I wish I like it too, <laughs> Victoria. <laughs> but thank you so much for two books. Oh my goodness. Right. 
we are on the last package and this is a thick boy so let's see what's happening here yay <gasps> two books what are these so we have when we make it by Elizabeth wait I can't say that Elizabeth um Elizabeth Velasquez. I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry. And Twisted Love by Anna Huang. Oh my goodness. Right, who are these from? Jordan, thank you so much, Jordan. Happy birthday, Lucy. I saw this on your wish list and I hope you love it. Twisted Love by Anna Kwong. Yes, I hope I love it too. Definitely. This, I don't really know what this is about. I've just seen, I've seen this all over TikTok and I need to read it. And then the next one says, I love this book and I definitely want to see more people reading it. I'm always curious on your thoughts on heavy books set in America since you studied the US. I hope you have a great birthday from Jordan. Thank you so much. I'm, this looks amazing. So this is, Saria is a first generation Puerto Rican question asker who sees the truth pain human and beauty of the world both inside and out her brushwick apartment saria knows that asking questions is the smartest thing she can do especially when navigating family trauma masculinity in its most toxic form and the systemic pressures of life in a rapidly gentrifying brooklyn questioning allows saria to live with determination and laughter and to celebrate herself in a way that has been long denied Oh my gosh, this is gonna be, this is gonna be a great read. When We Make It is an unforgettable debut novel in verse. Oh, it's a novel in verse, yes. Written in conversation with the Nironican poetry and literary that has come before it. Elizabeth's novel is a love letter to girls who were first taught to believe that they would not make it at all. For those born with stories already erased and those redefining what it means to make it every damn day this this oh thank you so much jordan i have never heard of this book and i'm so so thrilled that you got it for me this is actually going to be such a cool book oh she's even got the portrait i love this cover love this cover right let me put these gift notes in the correct books Oh my goodness, that 15 books right there. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much to everyone. Um, if you've got to see any video and want to leave me a comment, but you don't know what's comment, please leave me a heart emoji, any color, just a heart emoji, because I'm so thankful to all of you. I hope you're all safe and well, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. This is the aftermath of that haul. Yay! Hello everyone. Um, editing Lucy popping in here to say that I got another delivery. <laughs> Literally, I had already exported the video <laughs> when I got a knock on the door with this parcel. So I'm just going to quickly throw this in here. So let's open it. Oh, that's not going to work. There we go. Okay, let's see. Oh, let's see if there's a note in here. Ooh, there is. Diana, thank you. Happy birthday, Lucy. Hope you had an amazing day. I'm so glad I got to meet you this past year. Can't wait to finally see you in person in NOLA. I can't wait to meet you either, my darling. And she got me. The Inadequate Air by Danielle L. Jensen.
This is the third book in the Bridge Kingdom se se trilogy. So I'm so happy that I now have all three of them and I can I can read The Inheritance there. No. What's it called? The Traitor. Oh my God, what is the book called? Does it tell me? The Traitor Queen and the Inadequate Heir back to back. Yeah, I'm like, why did I forget what that was called? What is wrong with me? Don't answer that. Yes, thank you so much, Diana. And this is a way chunkier than the other two. How many pages? 550 pages. This is going to take me a while. But yeah, thank you so much. I am so happy.